let's talk about peace. We got a lot of guys around here faking the funk, calling themselves ministers of God and don't even know God. Huh? Because God did make an appearance. God did talk to some people. Yo, this they guy's talking voice, some, some real stuff right now. No semitude. But he talked to a people. There is literally no parking spots. All these people are at work. There's Maserati. I don't know what he's doing right in the Marta. I guess I'm just gonna have to park outside on the top deck today. My car's gonna be so hot when I get back. Whatever. Hello, I'm Jim Rockwell. Our program is People in Jazz, and today our man in jazz is Wes Montgomery. And many years ago, about 1959, well it was indeed in 1959, a dear old friend with whom I had been associated, owned a record company, which was Riverside, sent me a demonstration record of uh, an album he was about to release. And it was a guitarist then quite unknown. Georgia Aquarium World Coat. Um, I think Centennial Olympic Park. Everything's in here. I'm excited to see the little fountains. Uh, This is like the heart of Atlanta right now. Um, just checking everything out. Oh man, wow, this is really, 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 really beautiful. Look at this. There's a park over there. And then there's a Coca-Cola sign. Right in the middle of the street, over here. There we go. Okay, I'm just here with my friend. What's your name? Alejandro. Alejandro, he's from Mexico. And um, we're here looking at the locations of The Walking Dead that they filmed. And um, we just took some pictures of my friend Alejandro. And we're just walking around, found me a new friend today. So that's cool. Oh man, <laughs> my head is racing right now. Alejandro just left. I had to speak Spanish with him the whole time. He's from Mexico. He's here to uh, to be a journalist for uh, Mexico's playing uh, Panama. He said here in Atlanta today, and he's a journalist here. And um, and he was out here looking at all the Walking Dead locations that they've shot at. 
It was actually pretty cool. He showed me some uh, some cool locations that I didn't even know that they filmed it there. But yeah, I guess you learn something new every day. You see, I'm learning Italian too at the same time. So Italian and Spanish are like so 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 similar. They're both romance languages, and so they get mixed up in my head. And so when he first when he first came up to me, he was like, do you speak English? And I was like, oh, hablas español, <laughs> señor. <laughs> but no, it, it did take a while for it to like really click and everything. Even though today they're hiding. 